Fauzi Janadi is 16 years old and already a veteran of the Israeli prison system. In December, he was visiting shops in his home city of Hebron when protests started around him. His arrest was caught on camera. His parents gave us permission to interview Fauzi. He says he tried to flee the protest and didn't take part. Despite that, Israeli soldiers pushed him to the ground. One of them caught me, hit me on my chest with the butt of his rifle. He pushed me to the ground and then all started beating me. They arrested me and took me into detention and beat me again and cursed at me. He spent 20 days in detention and is currently out on bail. He was arrested on charges of throwing rocks and resisting arrest. The Israeli army says it's investigating his claim of innocence. He's having regular hospital treatment because his shoulder was broken during his arrest. His case is far from unique. Malek Galeth lives with her parents in the Jalazun refugee camp in Ramallah. It made me grow. No one enters prison as a child and leaves as such. They didn't allow me to call my family or a lawyer before investigation. They used pepper spray on me, called me names and beat me up. The help group at Defense of Children International is concerned that the Israeli military often makes violent arrests. The group says children often lack proper legal representation during the court process and the impact of detention lasts well into adulthood. What we see is that those three months or four months in, in military prison for having for stone throwing, for example, which is the most common charge, end up impacting the entire trajectory of that child's life. Palestinians in the occupied West Bank are subject to Israeli military law. Now, for a very long time, international human rights groups and local human rights groups have criticized the Israeli military courts for handing down harsh sentences. The illegal occupation of their land by Israeli forces is never far from children's lives here. The latest available total from the Israeli Prison Authority in November said 313 Palestinian minors are in jail for security offenses. Imran Khan, Al Jazeera, Hebron.